Originally bred to hunt, haul sledges, and herd reindeer, the Samoyed dog breed proved a valuable companion for northwestern Siberia's Samoyede people. Among the breed's duties, pack hiking, tracking, and warming their owners by sleeping on top of them at night. As a working breed, Sami can be strong-willed at times, but above all they remain friendly, gentle, and devoted family dogs. They're affectionate with almost everyone, so long as new people don't mind some shedding and stray hairs on their clothes. This is a happy, good-natured dog with a glass-half-full attitude toward life and the people he lives with. To this day, the Samoyed's reputation as an intelligent, dignified, family dog is well-deserved. He often chooses to dote on one special person in the household, but he is affectionate with everyone in the pack. History. The hardy and sweet-tempered Samoyed was originally used to hunt, herd reindeer, and haul sledges for the Siberian Samoyede people. It is said that the Samoyede treated these working dogs kindly, allowing them to join in with family activities at the end of a day. It was this closeness that created a sense of trust and loyalty in the breed that remains today. The Samoyed journeyed out of Siberia at the end of the 19th century and the early part of the 20th century to pull sledges on polar expeditions, including Sir Ernest Shackleton's famous journey to the Antarctic. These dogs endured terrible hardships along with the explorers they assisted. Only the strongest and fittest dogs survived such expeditions. A Samoyed named Antarctic Buck is said to be the very first brought to England. Queen Alexandra was an enthusiast of the breed and many present-day English and American Sammies are descended from her kennels. The first standard for the breed was adopted in England in 1909. The original Samoyed Club of America was organized in 1923, the same year the American breed standard was adopted. Personality. The well-bred Samoyed is an intelligent, gentle, and loyal dog. He is friendly and affectionate with his family, including the children, and thrives on being part of household activity. The Samoyed is not a lone wolf dog, he enjoys close association with those he lives and is mentally and physically unsuited for being left alone in a kennel or backyard. His loyalty and alertness often make for a good watchdog. At heart, the Samoyed is still a hunter. He is likely to chase after small animals that he perceives as prey. For his safety, he should always be leashed when he's not at home in his fenced yard. Temperament is affected by a number of factors, including heredity, training, and socialization. Puppies with nice temperaments are curious and playful, willing to approach people and be held by them. Health. Before we go on, don't forget to like and share if you enjoy our content. Please hit the subscribe button to get notified when we post more pet-related content. Liking and sharing our content helps massively with the growth of our channel. So it's very much appreciated. Samoyeds are generally healthy, but like all breeds, they're prone to certain health conditions. Not all Sammies will get any or all of these diseases, but it's important to be aware of them if you're considering this breed. If you're buying a puppy, find a good breeder who will show you health clearances for both your puppy's parents. Health clearances prove that a dog has been tested for and cleared of a particular condition. Care. This active breed is not suited to apartment or condo life. A home with a large, securely fenced yard is the best choice. Because the Samoyed is a working dog, he needs room to romp and play. Keep him mentally challenged with ongoing training and dog sports. Allow him to become bored and he's likely to dig, escape, or chew to entertain himself. Note. The Samoyed should be kept on leash whenever he's in public, he seldom can resist the lure of small, scurrying animals. With his Nordic heritage, he is a natural fit for cold climates, and he loves to play in the snow. Conversely, with his thick coat, he can be sensitive to heat. Do not allow him to exercise strenuously when it is extremely hot, limit high-level activity to early morning or evening when it's cooler. During the heat of the day, Keep your Sammy inside with fans or air conditioning. Feeding. Recommended daily amount. 1.5 to 2.5 cups of high-quality dry food a day, divided into two meals. How much your adult dog eats depends on his size, age, build, metabolism, and activity level. Dogs are individuals, just like people, and they don't all need the same amount of food. It almost goes without saying that a highly active dog will need more than a couch potato dog. 
The quality of dog food you buy also makes a difference. The better the dog food, the further it will go toward nourishing your dog and the less of it you'll need to shake into your dog's bowl. Samoyed puppies need slow, steady growth. Feed a good quality diet with 22 to 24% protein and 12 to 15% fat. Keep your Sammy in good shape by measuring his food and feeding him twice a day rather than leaving food out all the time. Coat Care and Grooming The Samoyed has a straight outer coat and a soft, thick undercoat, often referred to as wool. It can be pure white, white and biscuit, cream, or biscuit and sheds heavily. Maintenance can be daunting. Daily brushing is necessary when the coat is shedding, once or twice a week when it's not. He'll need bathing about once every eight weeks, or whenever he rolls in mud or something smelly. Bathing the Samoyed is a time commitment too, as thoroughly soaking the coat, rinsing out the shampoo, and letting it dry completely is no quick process. Many owners opt to hire a professional groomer. Though costly, it helps to take some burden off the owner. However, you still need to brush regularly, 